was looking at my computer and I saw flashing up a, uh, um, <laughs> a, a sort of a, an unexpected little news item that said that there had been a shooting in Pittsburgh, but it didn't spell Pittsburgh with an H, it spelled with a G. So first I thought, oh God, that's terrible. Oh, it's, oh okay, it's not our Pittsburgh because I used to live in Pittsburgh. Um, we try to impact our world, especially locally here, just by bringing some culture to it. I feel most impacted from the world in Pittsburgh, specifically by going to different restaurants and trying new foods from different cultures. We live in a very globalized society as of today where I feel that, um, I think of that term, it's um, think globally, act locally. And then, uh, and then I suddenly started getting information and realized, oh, it is our Pittsburgh. And I thought, wow, that's, you know, it was horrible before, but now it's really hitting close to home. Every individual person leaves an impact on the world. No matter how small it's a collective, it's a very large impact. The world really impacts me through my students. You don't realize how sheltered you are until you get to a big city. And then I um, heard that it was in a synagogue, and um, I'm Jewish, and so I kind of thought more about that. And then I recognized the name of the synagogue and realized that it was where I just um, went to the funeral of my um, dissertation advisor from Carnegie Mellon a little over almost two years ago. I impact the world because my three young children are learning how to, to, to be humans in this, on this earth and in this world and me and my husband are hoping to raise them to be strong global citizens. So I like to welcome people into my home and expose them to new foods and I think that it not only impacts me by teaching them different foods and where it comes from, but also impacts them as well because they can take those stories with them and express them with other people. In every single space that I've ever been in, the world has impacted me and I have been able to impact the world in a very distinct and separate kind of way. And then I immediately got worried that maybe his wife was there. I spent the day reaching out to other parts of the world where people I knew from Pittsburgh were um, now living to sort of see if they knew anything about whether Joyce was um, at the, <laughs> there and um, and so um, by the end of the day I um, was in Salem Massachusetts with my daughter and um, when I got a message from my friend that said she didn't make it <laughs> I didn't understand so I wrote back and he said I don't have any words and all my worlds kind of came together and uh, I decided to come down to Pittsburgh to go to Joyce's funeral who I last saw at her husband's funeral um, and so the world sometimes gets very big and then it just kind of comes crashing down on you. We want them to realize that not only are they citizens of our country, but they are citizens of our globe and with every decision that they make, there is some sort of consequence, not just to the community around them, but to the, to the world at large. When I read about the shooter's um, motives, uh, that he was angry because in his mind, not correctly, a lot of Jews have been helpful to resettling refugees, but his, his ideology was that it's like diluting, you know, some race. Um, I thought about how, well, good, maybe it'll continue to bring Jews and Muslims and immigrants and refugees together. I feel that the world impacts me in the sense that there's now a large exchange of information. I think the most important thing is making sure the people around you have a community or somewhere where they feel comfortable to be themselves and like stay positive, like things like that. I don't know how I impact the world. I guess I'll find out maybe someday as I try to in my, in teach my courses, I try to um, do what I can to get people to think and kind of come together. But I guess that's one of the things about, uh, you know, every once in a while you get a letter from an old student who says that you had an impact in ways that you never expected. and or you bump into someone and you remember certain stories and they remember others, but I guess I don't really have a good sense of how I have an impact on others, but I hope I have mostly a positive one. In Pittsburgh, I meet the world through trying new foods of different cultures. In Pittsburgh, I meet the world through my customers' eyes. In Pittsburgh, I meet the world through its people, its neighborhoods, and its incredible diversity and intersectionality in all that it does. It's a beautiful world, especially living in a city. It's, it's everything that defines who I am. Fight, hate, with love.
pick your favorite dish or your favorite restaurant? My favorite dish is probably anything with potatoes. Um, and my favorite restaurant would probably be Solemn's Grill here in the Strip District. Perfect. Do you want another question? 